To lock the scrum, St George has Johnny Raper, rated the best in the world. The legendary commentator Frank Hyde once remarked, when Johnny Raper was born, they not only destroyed the mould, they pulped it. A ball playing forward, he could turn matches in attack and defence. With powerhouse tackling, his cover defence is outstanding. And when he decides to attack, it's a delight to watch. Raper started his career at Newtown, but it was with the St George Dragons where he became rugby league royalty, playing in eight successive grand final wins from 1959 to 1966. I think the thing that separates John Raper, he was magnificent at everything. He was the, su the supreme all-rounder. Raper also gained an edge over his rivals off the field, bringing a new intensity to training at a time when the game was still only semi-professional. I went to a club that, I, that taught me a lot about professionalism, not only on the football field, but off the football field. He played in 39 tests for Australia. That included the 1968 World Cup final, when he led the Kangaroos to victory against France. Raper reaches an unforgettable climax in his remarkable international career. On one tour, an urban legend emerged about a player walking down a Yorkshire street in nothing but a bowler hat. Johnny Raper denied it was him. It's too, too bloody cold out there. Imagine running down the street with a bowler hat and with no, nothing on. But not before he had fun with the story, wearing the headpiece in a series of famous commercials. Jack's tyres get no sleep, they're open seven days a week. Jack's to the baton and with the deals and using the name for his autobiography. He was a larrikin, he loved life, he played footy as good as anyone I've ever, ever seen. Chuck was a pretty special person, I tell you. He, he was, he really was. Johnny Raper was named as one of the sport's four original immortals, a title considered the highest honour in the game. The Dragons say they will commemorate his life and career at their first home game of the season next month.